next one. Eric Anders versus Darren Stewart. Uh, is it Anders? It's Anders. The dentist. Yeah, I love that nickname, actually. Um, not All more of the than, dentist. <laughs> not more than Euros Medic's nickname, The Doctor. Love that. Um, yeah. <laughs> is 5-5 five and five in the UFC. Has been... Two, he is two and four in his last six. Likes to strike, wins sixty two percent by KO, but has a negative one point one five strike differential. Takes a lot of damage. Has a decent ground game. Um, take he likes to take down guys that just like ground and pound mostly. Um, not really into the whole submission thing. Um, he's taken on Darren Stewart, also five and five in the UFC. Uh, yeah, but Darren Stewart. Well, I'll let you go. Yeah, Darren Stewart's a real gatekeeper for trash. Um, if you're trash, Darren Stewart will beat you. But if you're good, um, like you'll get a nice win over Darren Stewart. Although he did put up a strong performance in his loss to Kevin Holland, and a split decision in a pretty close fight. I was gonna say he gave Kevin Holland his toughest fight of 2020. I know. I was um actually gonna. I was gonna say this later, but. I think that um, – I'm just going to say it now. I'm picking Darren Stewart. And I think that he has been picking up steam as of recently. He did terrible in um, the beginning of his UFC career. He went one in three with one no contest just for his first five UFC fights. Um, and since then, he's kind of like switched up a little bit. He slowed his game down. He's been going to decision a lot. Five out of his last six fights have gone to decision. Um, same thing with um, Anders, actually. Um, so this fight is one of those fights that I said also bet decision. I think it's probably going to go there. I'm going to go with Stewart though. I think he's starting to put the pieces together um, to his like his slow UFC. He had a slow start. He looked like trash, and for a while I thought he was hot trash. But you know he's what? Not. He's not. He's he's picking up. He's picking up steam. We saw that against Kevin Holland. Let me tell you. Okay. Yeah. Right. Let me tell you something. What's up? Two out of his last three losses are split decision losses to Edmund Shabazian Big. and Kevin Holland. Big. Both better than Eric Anders. I'm going Darren Stewart all the way. I think he can maybe even finish it. 100% agree with what you said. Yeah. He's putting the pieces together. The dentist is going to bring it home. Um, then maybe go fix up, uh, fix up uh, the teeth in England because I know the dental system. <laughs> that dude, that's perfect. <laughs> um that's great you got his his retirement set out too um yeah, yeah eric i don't think he's an actual dentist <laughs> might be you know it's yeah. a shame. eric anders had a lot of hype coming into the ufc and it's kind of weird he had a lot of hype coming into ufc and darren stewart was was doing really bad really poor in the beginning yeah uh, but that's good I'm i'm glad we uh agree on that one 